What's up guys, Fuse Theme here, back with another video. In today's video, I'm going to be telling you how to organize your inventory in Apex Legends Season 6. So, if you guys don't, um, you guys probably know, um, how, um, to organize your inventory, but some of you might not. Like, for example, you might put more grenades than heal healables, or more healables than ammo, or more ammo than healables. Some, you, you get the gist. Um, and I'm going to be showing you how I organize my loadout. Just to give you guys a general idea of how to organize your or, or um, your loadout uh, regularly on a daily basis, just because there might be people that put too little ammo, but too much meds, but too little um, too little meds, but too much and too much ammo, uh, because there is a there is a thing called too much meds, too much ammo, and in, in a game like Apex, everything's crucial, like everything, meds, na uh, meds, ammo, everything. So for the purpose of this video, I'm going to pick up a purple backpack just because, yeah. And I'm going to be showing you the meds first. For um, for some casually playing Apex, I like to pick up uh, at least one Phoenix kit. You should never have more than one Phoenix kit. And I like to pick up one Phoenix kit and two shield batteries and one med kit. The reason because of this is because you normally um, use at least one shield battery or at least one med kit um, in a gunfight. And um, never really use up all your med kits and all your shield batteries. And one after a fight, your the enemy team um, should have a couple of shield batteries just so you can replenish your healables. And yeah, so um, for light meds, um, syringes and shield cells, I like to keep it simple and put four syringes and twelve shield cells. The reason I ha I would um, grab twelve shield cells and only four syringes is because you almost never use syringes in a gunfight. You normally just use shield batteries and shield cells, and on some occasion you use medkits. And but in those tricky gunfights, you most time use phoenix kits as well. Like you don't see yourself popping some syringes. Most time, um, you use syringes as like a last resort on case you're running low on shield cells or like um, don't even have any shield cells or shield batteries. Um, usually, just popping a medkit would be nice. But shield cells are so incredibly good because of not only the low, um, the low um, time it takes to apply them, but also because of how um, how great shield cells are in general. Um, if I'm being honest, like they're really good when it comes to actual combat. They're quick and easy to use. That's basically the whole general idea. So when it comes, now, let's talk about ammo. But before we talk about ammo, I'm just going to grab my loadout, my normal loadout that I would grab in the game. My this really comes to per um, personal preference, but I like to have the flatline bolt loadout. And let me just pick up these attachments right here. And these are basically the attachments I would use in a regular game. So um, my attachments might be different from your attachments just because of um, whatever. Like I said, this is all peripheral um, personal preference. And the reason why I have a one-time sight than a two times or a digital threat is because I just think the cracked uh, one time scope is just I feel like my aim is a lot more steady um, and a lot less uh, shaky if that makes sense and same with the flatline I like I don't like using the bruiser but sometimes I was trying to switch it up with the bruiser um, uh, so yeah so uh, now let's talk about ammo with ammo you should normally have it really depends on which guns you have for example um, since I'm rocking a Volt, I would um, like to carry, I see, three to four stacks. Uh, because Volts shred through eat energy ammo for breakfast, um, lunch, and dinner. And the Flatline normally is like kind of mediocre when it comes to ammo. So I'd like to keep it at three stacks. Um, let's say you have a Sniper. And in that case, you would want to carry two stacks just because... Uh, Snipers don't really use that much energy, uh, sniper ammo. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video, and be sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel if you're new, and turn on post notifications. And I'll see you guys next time. Peace!